The $800 million restoration of Paris's La Samaritaine department store. Keep looking and discover the lavish opulence of this luxury store. Welcome to Paris Travel France, the channel for fashion, art, food and much more in and around Paris. After being closed for 15 years, La Samaritaine has emerged from the ashes. Reopening in June 2021 after a thorough renovation and significant delays brought on by the global pandemic. The department store is housed in a steel frame and glass Art Nouveau structure designed by Belgian architect Franz Jourdain and located in the first arrondissement on the right bank of the Seine. Numerous experienced artists, including painters, sculptors, gilders, ironworkers, and more, were brought in to work on the massive repair and reconstruction project, which took up 70,000 square meters in the center of the French city. At its height, 800 artisans were collaborating there. Today, this legendary department store hopes to become the new center of chic Paris. It will lure tourists from across the world eager to get a taste of a particular French way of life as well as Parisians and visitors from all over France excited to return to a much-loved location. La Samaritaine had been a dependable part of the cityscape since 1869, with its powerfully lettered Art Nouveau front rising over the Seine River and the Pont Neuf Bridge. It was unquestionably legendary. But in 2005, the beloved 19th-century store of many Parisians was forced to close its doors because of serious building safety concerns and some questionable financial actions. It had taken 15 years and cost more than $800 million to restore the famous Parisian store La Samaritaine, affectionately known as La Samar by Parisians. The attention that was put into rehabilitating this architectural gem, which is famed for its Art Nouveau and Art Deco elements, may be more noteworthy than the retail options. To see the magnificent Art Nouveau peacock fresco restored to its full splendor, use the elevators to the top floor. It was designed by Francis Jourdain, son of the architect and measures 3.5 meters high and 115 meters long. Customers can also ascend the 270 original oak steps as an alternative. The restoration of the railing includes 16,000 gold leaves. Led by the luxury goods distributor LVMH Group, the refurbishment of the recently renamed La Samaritaine Paris Pont Neuf was a massive endeavor that engaged 280 French companies as well as a Japanese architecture firm. The finished product is a block-long complex that includes a store with more than 600 fashion brands. Shopping, dining, and culture are all part of the French art de vivre, which is housed in La Samaritaine. Think of Alexander McQueen, Chloe, Chanel, Piaget, and Tiffany & Co. as examples of the numerous fashion and jewelry houses that have been carefully chosen to give a distinctively French mix-and-match aesthetic. But shopping is not the only thing to do in La Samaritaine. It contains the largest beauty and wellness area, 10 restaurants, cafes, and tea rooms, as well as the five-star Cheval Blanc Paris Hotel with 72 rooms and suites and a Dior spa. Even 96 public housing units and a daycare facility are present. The new Palace Hotel from the five-star Cheval Blanc Group was inaugurated at the time of the reopening, dramatically raising the bar for high-luxury accommodations. A spa, personal shopping services, a beauty studio, a concierge, and other upscale amenities are also available. Finally, there are both formal and casual dining options available. Paris has been waiting a long time for the reopening of its largest and most beloved department store. But this luxury store is finally back in the city. Come by quickly to take a look. This was the video for now, thank you for watching. Like and subscribe for more Paris travel if you like Paris, France, fashion, food, hotels, real estate and art. See you next time.